Hey guys, so today I'm filming a what's in my everyday makeup bag video. Um, this makeup bag is truly what I use every single day. It sits on my makeup counter, or not my makeup counter, my bathroom counter. It never moves, it's always on my bathroom counter. It's every single thing that I use on a daily basis. And then I have an actual like armoire type thing, like a chest where I have my entire makeup collection. But I very rarely go in there because I use the same makeup pretty much every single day. So this is pretty much what I go into. And then if I want like a bright lipstick or something, then I'll go into my makeup collection. But for the most part, every single day, this is what I use, all these products and whatnot. So actual makeup bag if you're interested. It's pretty old though, I got it like, a year and a half ago maybe. Um, it's by Kate Spade but it's really pretty. It has the Kate Spade label and it has this really big bow on it and it's pretty large. Like if you can tell it's a really big makeup bag um, and it's really nice. It has like a leather pole and it's bright red on the inside. I really like it. It's very very um very sturdy and good quality. I do keep my brushes in my makeup bag like this every single day. I don't let them sit out on the counter because these are my most used brushes. I have all of my other brushes like displayed nicely by my makeup by my makeup collection, but I just throw these in here every day like this, like on its side, and then I zip it up. I feel like it's just more clean to have it all zipped up and tucked away on my counter, but um, it also makes my makeup bag a mess. But anyway, so I pull this out. This is my brushes. I pull these out, you know, obviously before I do my makeup every day. And these are the only brushes I use. They're all Sigma, well, besides one, I think. Um, and there, I actually have a couple doubles in here, so I'm not gonna go through every single one of these brushes, but they are all Sigma. Just the big fluffy brush, the angled brush for my bronzer. Um, this is a highlighting brush, and then these are all of my eye brushes and um, eyebrow brush, and I actually keep my mascara and my eyeliner in here too. I don't know why I do that, um, but the mascara that I use almost every single day is my Maybelline Colossal Volume. Love, 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 love. And my Stila Smudge Stick and Stingray is the black eyeliner that I use every day, and I keep those in here. Like, I have doubles, like these two paddle brushes from Sigma um, I use for all over lid color. I have two pencil brushes, the same exact ones I use for my highlight. Um, so I have a couple doubles and then my face brushes. So I will list all of these brushes in the description box down below if you're interested. I just don't want to take a lot of time and read each individual number. Um, but if you're in the market for any kind of new brush, those are my, that's all I use for my entire face. So I'll have them listed down below if you're interested. Okay, on to the actual makeup. If you're familiar with um, my everyday makeup routines and stuff like that, you're going to see a lot of the same things here. But this is what I, it looks like. I honestly don't have that much stuff. Um, but of course, I have my foundation, my Tarte Amazonian Clay Full Coverage in the shade Medium. I naked two palette in here because I've been trying to use it more because I, <laughs> I'm so stuck on my everyday eye makeup routine, which is what I'm wearing right now. Link right here. Um, I haven't really been using this that much, but I've tried to, so that's why I keep it in my makeup bag. Then I have my Park Avenue Princess Bronzer and my Park Avenue Princess matte waterproof bronzer so one is matte waterproof version one is like the regular version this is what they look like you can tell i use them a lot the matte waterproof one i use with the big fluffy brush by sigma i put it all over my face um it sets my foundation and then the regular park avenue princess bronzer i use it on my cheeks a lot so a lot of people ask me what's on my cheeks in most of my videos this is literally um what i use most of the time so i love these then I have my MAC eyeshadow palette, which is like my go-to one right now. Um, you can tell I use a lot of the same colors. And there's a row missing, but I've been trying to reorganize my MAC palettes because I have quite a few and I just never have gotten around to it. I'm really lazy. I have my Smashbox Brow Tech, which I use this. I use this for my eyebrows every single day. Um, yeah, it's just two shadows for your eyebrows and then a wax, which I never use a wax, and I only use one of the shadows, so I should probably stop buying this because I'm wasting two of the products, but that's what I use for my eyebrows every day. Um, my concealer right now is the Amazing Cosmetics Amazing Concealer, which I show that in my everyday foundation routine right here. My MAC Pantoly Paint Pot, which I use to prime my eyes for my shadow. Then I have a bunch of lip products, and depending on what lip product I use, Usually that day it'll go into my purse, um, but the ones I have in here right now are just all by Buxom because that's like my go-to gloss. Just three different pink shades. I know they all kind of look the same, but they're not. And then my, my Buxom Big and Healthy Lipstick Pencil, which I use to put on my lips every single day because my lips are naturally pretty like reddish in tone. So this is the color London. It's like a baby pink. I'll put that on every single day because it kind of makes my lips appear lighter so the glosses appear more true to color. Um, so love those. And then I have a YSL number two lipstick, which is just a nude color. So that's all that's in the actual makeup bag, and you can tell it's really dirty and gross. I've actually tried to clean it, but 
it's like permanent in there. Then I have this cute little like side pocket that I keep random stuff in, like kind of essentials though, so I'll show that real quick. I have my Betsy Johnson um, Tweezer Man tweezers, which I use these a lot. My eyebrows grow like insane. And these are the, um, yeah, the Betsy Johnson versions, so I think they're really cute because they have little flowers and it says XOXO Betsy. It's upside down, <laughs> but those are really cute. I have a highlighter in here, a MAC Mineralized, Mineralized Skin Finish. It's the color by Candlelight. I haven't been highlighting that much lately. Um, it's just a pretty shimmery highlight. You can put it like on your cheekbones, on your nose, on your cupid's bow. I haven't been using it that much lately, so I, if I have a, ma a makeup product in my makeup bag that I tend to not really, if I start to not use it a lot, I'll put it in this little pocket. And then if it's been a couple months, then I'll put it back into like my makeup collection because I'm not using it. So that'll probably go back soon. Um, then I have just a eyelash adhesive, eyelash duo eyelash adhesive. The dark shade and hair ties and my bubblegum blowout philosophy lip gloss which I haven't used that in forever um, I have a Mac eyeshadow in the shade woodwinked which it's not depotted but it's one of their prettiest shades I think I was using that for a couple for a little bit and then I have these little scissors which I actually use these to trim my eyebrows because my eyebrows I seriously they grow so much and so fast and they're so long and so I'll actually just put the scissors like this and cut them so they're like even because they grow so long so that's what I use those scissors for and then I just have a MAC eyeliner pencil sharpener when I used to have the actual pencil eyeliner now I use the seal one um, so yeah, now that I have a massive, massive mess in front of me, like I should show you guys, but I won't dare to, um, that is pretty much everything in my makeup bag. So I hope you enjoyed this video. It kind of gives you a little insight onto all the makeup that I use, even though this truly is like, I've showed it in a lot of my videos, but I kind of tend to stick to something when I like it. And I've been loving all this makeup and these brands lately. So I hope you enjoyed this video. If you want to do this video, you can leave it as a video response and don't forget to check out my vlog channel. I've been vlogging every single day. Um, Miss Jen Vlogs is my vlog channel. I have it linked on this video somewhere and down below in the description box. And my blog, polishandpearls.com. Um, yeah, but that's pretty much it, guys. So any questions about the makeup shown, you can ask me in the comments or just let me know what you think of this video. And I'll talk to you guys very soon. Bye.